No, okay. <laughs> well, maybe you have something to learn from Curious George. <laughs> Curious George <coughs> has all sorts of adventures. He is always curious. And being curious is what leads him into his adventures. That's what gets his adventure started. Sometimes, often, it gets him into some trouble. But usually, it is how he learns and has fun, experiences new things. So today, I'm encouraging us to take a lesson from Curious George. And one way that we can be curious is by asking people questions about themselves and learning new things about them. The story from the Bible that we are going to hear in just a few minutes talks about a woman and a man who meet at a well. And they were very different from each other, but they were both curious. And so they had a conversation and asked each other questions and learned from each other. In fact, the woman learned that the man that she met at the well was Jesus and that he had come to share God's love with her and with the whole world. She learned that by talking to him and asking him questions, by being curious. When we stay curious, especially about other people, we can learn all sorts of things, not just about who they are, but about who God is and about how God loves us. So let's try to be curious about other people this week and ask them questions about themselves. Maybe a friend or a family member or maybe someone you see at the grocery store. Try to be curious. I wish Gary was here because I know how much he loves <laughs> Curious George, but I'll have to send him a text and let him know. <laughs> let us pray. God, we thank you for making us people who can ask questions. We thank you for all the differences we have and how we can learn about them by asking each other questions about who we are and what we do and what we love. Help us to stay curious this week and just surprise us by what we might learn about others and about you. Amen. <laughs> 